When it rains, it floods outside Deb Pizzamenti's home on Gray Twig Lane near White City. The water comes halfway up the shed. You can almost see a water line. This video shows where the water builds up, affecting the entire neighborhood. I just feel like maybe the water is going to sit more in our yard. It's not far from a proposed shopping center that neighbors believe will make their water worries worse. I've been living on this street for 13 years now, and in that time, we have had flooding like you can't imagine. Pizamenti's home sits just behind the five acre property at Midway Road and 25th Street. This is where developers want to put five new buildings, a plan that includes a Bravo grocery store, a Mexican restaurant, and commercial space. What you're doing is you're pushing water towards our foundations, and that's going to impede the structure of my home. I took their concerns to the county. The site itself, if it were to be developed, would need to account for and capture its uh, storm water on site. Planning manager Corey Benton says the county is still working with the developer EDC Incorporated to figure out how to address the issue. The proposal will come back before commissioners on October 1st. If it uh, advances, that's when a greater topography, uh, a more uh, robust stormwater plan would need to be designed. Residents say doing nothing is not an option. Work something out that, you know, is suitable. Cassandra Garcia, WPTV News.